Did you always dream that you were going to be an actor? Was this something from when you were a kid? I thought I would be involved. In, I knew I was not cut out for the workforce in a normal way. I right. just knew. I just knew my attention span was off. And I said, there's something different. So you feel like kind of a misfit. But I did have a sense of humor. But, and, the, thing, but, but the thing is, when you wrote Rocky, yeah. and, and then finally, I mean, you were broke. And you write Rocky, and the right. studios like it. You finally right. get acceptance, right. and they say, okay, look, we don't want, you say, right. I want to be the star of this movie. Right. And they go, look, man, you're nobody. That's true. And you turn down how much money for them to just buy the just buy the film and put, I don't know, who they want to put in there to start. They want to put Ryan O'Neill, Jimmy Kahn. Uh, uh, they wanted to put Nick Nolte. Did people say to you, listen, Sylvester, you'll get your chance to act. Sell the movie, make some money. Including my agents. They said, well, are you crazy? This is ridiculous money. $360,000 by standards back then. No, I said, look, guys, I, I really mastered the method of living on nothing, of eating basically cobwebs. And it's okay. I'm not. I, I know in my mind if I sell it now and it becomes good, you'll it, kill yourself. I will kill myself. There's no how question. long? How long did you have to hold that? Now, in other words, they said to you, "Here's three hundred sixty thousand dollars for Wright and Rocky. Go away and leave us alone." About about three months. But to the here's what's different in Hollywood: the producers there went against the system and had to mortgage their own houses. Mortgage their houses to get the money up and get the studio behind in, in the bond mm -hmm. to guarantee. Right. Try that today. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Who did you pressure? Like, who was, what studio and who was the United studio? Artists. United Artists. United and Artists. And they sat down. You said, we love your script, but you cannot yeah. do this. Yeah, and you said, you? I'm walking away from 360000 yeah. So when did you get the call that finally, okay, we'll, we'll let you start it? Did you have to go audition for them? Well, no, what it is is they finally broke it down and said, we can do this film. If you're going to be in it, we have a 14, the, no, it was a 14 day thing where we can fire you anytime if, right. if you do anything wrong. And, and more importantly, we can reduce it down to... 900 grand all in and if you can do the thing in under 30 days okay if not it's it's over so did you shoot the whole thing in, in uh, 28 days 28 days the mm -hmm. whole first rocket the whole thing Unbelievable! I know it is. It's, I can, why can't I do that every time? What happened? I know. Because, because it becomes too important. And bigger, right? It becomes too important. But if you would just knock out movies like that without all that, in that, that it, it, it's you the truth, right? Spoiled. No, but, it, it but is, you're it afraid of failure in a sense. I know. It's like what happened? It's great when you're working out there and you're changing the back of a uh, a pickup truck. It all there's a certain kind of energy about it, and you don't become so caught up in my right angle, my makeup, this and that, and things happen that are so visceral. But you're right. As we become more pampered, more spoiled, more reserved, we take a little longer again to the set. This right. and, that. and you know what? You lose your edge. You lose your edge. Yeah, there's no doubt about it. Everyone's best work. When you were starving, five years. You wrote. How long did it take you to write Rocky? I mean, literally sit down and start writing it. Well, it took about. This will sound pretentious, but it took three days, of which 90% was terrible. Mm -hmm. But right. the German, the idea was there. Right. That was it. So, and then after that, it took maybe 25 rewrites. You have to keep going, like. One day you'll say, can we make the black guy Jamaican? Can we make this guy? So you have to make, okay, man, you have to change all the dialogue. Awesome. And then you come back, pow, pow, two and three, bam, big. Rambo. You didn't write the first Rambo? Yeah, what I did is it was based on a book, though. You did write it. Oh, okay. I, thought I told you he wrote it. Originally, yeah. uh, just was in somebody else's movie. No, uh, such a see, Ram movie. Ram Rambo had been around for. Actually, I think they were going to lab animals before they got to me. They went through every actor in the system, and they eventually said, "Okay, let me go there." De Niro, thing, Nick Nolte, Zippy the monkey. Let's go to Sly. <laughs> right. And and <laughs> I looked at this. I'm going. Yeah. This is a career killer. Right. This film when we did it. Uh, it was so bad, at least I thought. Right. And even my manager, we, we both went out. I think we both retched together in the alley. Said, <laughs> we tried to buy it back and burn the negative. Which film? Really? Really? First Blood. You're kidding. I, you on my, thought that? On my children, we tried to buy it back and burn the negative. You thought it was a bad movie? Well, the, originally, it was three hours long. I stayed an hour and a half in the woods chasing guys. And, I mean, it was, and plus, I was pontificating throughout the thing. For example, I shoot an owl. And then the owl drops. I go, take that, you mouse munching mother. Oh. I said, I can't say that. And then there'd be lines like, uh, the, the cop pulls me over and he goes, where do you think you're going? I go, did you ever see Easy Rider? Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm Easy Walker. So how and did you I'm fix the movie? What well, did you do? I you said, edited. here's a good idea. Cut out all my dialogue. All right. Every every line, and have other people talk about you. Which, by the way, is not a bad which, way to live in general. <laughs> which, by the way, all the great movies made, all the, great all the heroes movies. hardly say yeah. anything. Exactly right. Other people fill in the blanks, That's right. like right. the Greek chorus, you know. And I think that works. And really then well. when you saw it played back, you said, "This is a good movie." This works. And then we, you knew. 
Howard, it went from three hours to 90 minutes. That's great. 90 tight minutes. 90 tight minutes. <laughs> this is so great.